Hey, welcome back to the shop. My name is Brock Hashimoto, and today I have to fix a problem. And that problem is I need a new bottle opener. And sadly, this is the only bottle lap opener, no, not can opener, bottle opener I have in the house. Uh, the couple problems with this thing, well, it's uh, on my can opener. And two, the reach between this little hook and the end here is just way too short. It's a pain in the butt to get a bottle cap on there and off, and it just is a sad excuse. So uh, today we're gonna turn this piece of steel into this bottle opener. So stay tuned. All right, so I've got this two inch by eighth inch steel. Uh, I think we're gonna go with this instead. So. I actually like the thickness of the inch and a half. This is two inches, as I said before. So we're gonna remove about a half inch from this and um, go from there. Really, I could use a welding table for this. We're gonna take this over to the sander, uh, uh, clean up these edges, and uh, we're gonna drill the hole again. Here we go. I'm gonna have to do the majority of the shaping around the edges here with my angle grinder, and then uh, do the last little bit with um, the 80 grit sandpaper over here. pretty but we'll make it look pretty all right so uh, now it's time to work on this end so I'm actually gonna drill a you know, starting the drill press but I'm gonna drill a 3 8 hole so um, in four corners over here so that I can put my uh, use my metal cutting blade on my jigsaw and cut this out
All right, that's gonna wrap up today's project. I hope you learned something and took something away from this project. Uh, not really a whole lot of metal working going on here. Uh, mostly metal shaping, but no welding, which is good. Well, they're just cutting and filing and sanding, so nothing too crazy. A great beginner project. Um, you don't need an angle grinder. You could use a hacksaw blade, uh, hacksaw with a metal cutting blade on it. Uh, I had a drill press, but you could just use a drill and a drill bit to make the holes that you needed. Um, oh, jeez. File just to do the last little bit of shaping, some sandpaper. Um, pretty easy. Now, uh, the, you know, this was the first one I've ever made, so, uh, and my hole saw bit had some issues, so that was fun. But, uh, you know, there's a few imperfections here and there. Um, it's not exactly perfect, but it functions, and that's really all that matters. And it's beef. Eight inch thick steel. Uh, definitely has some weight to it and it's definitely not going anywhere. You can use this thing as a pry bar. But, uh, so anyways, I hope you like this video. If you do, smash that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you on the next video. Thanks. All right, that's going to wrap up today's project. I hope this is in focus. All right, that's going to wrap us up for today's wrap us up. I'm going to wrap us up. I'm going to wrap you up. <laughs>